Hello today, my name is Kyle Wilson and today I'm going to be talking about American Electric Corporations and a conflict of interest that we've noticed. So American Electric Corporation has a hog CAFO, which is a confined animal feeding operation in Edenton and it's creating a lot of pollution. Pollution is a huge problem in America and in the world today. 60% of Americans live in areas where air pollution has reached unhealthy levels that can make people very sick. This is one hog CAFO, or like I said, a combined animal feeding operation, where thousands of animals are confined to live and breed for optimal, optimal profit. The CAFO in Edenton alone raises more than, than 100,000 hogs. Part of pollution is airborne particulate matter, and a lot of this is found near CAFOs and can carry disease-causing bacteria, fungus, or other pathogens. Along with this, 35 to 40 percent of global methane emissions come from livestock, and 65 percent of this comes from, and 65 percent of nitrous oxide emissions also comes from livestock. So what is happening? While some action is being taken to combat these emissions, it can still be very harmful to residents in the area. And one of the biggest problems is the food that these animals are receiving. Because what goes in must come out. It's the same for humans, it's the same for animals. If something bad goes in, then something bad will come out. So the food given to the hogs is the main source of the problem, and this is because of the hormones that are in the food. The hormones are fed to the hogs and it's resulting in a neurological problem for humans. It's being, the hormones are being released in the waste of the pigs and polluting the air in the city. So what can be done? American Electrical Corporation owns many companies in the area and stands to lose a lot of money if this problem isn't corrected in a timely and responsible manner. AEC is big enough to make the changes necessary that will positively affect everyone involved. So the first thing that they can do is correct the mistakes. They can ensure that the hogs will no longer receive the hormones and develop a plan to dispose of the waste in a way that won't pollute the community anymore. The second is financial restitution. They can develop a fund to contribute to the medical costs of those affected by the pollution of the CAFO. And third is to raise awareness. Start a foundation or another way to encourage other CAFOs in the US and in the world to um, so they can avoid pollution. So why should they do this? Why should AC put so much time, effort, and money into this problem? This is a big problem affecting many people in the area and could turn into something very bad and a lot of bad publicity for the company if word gets out that AEC knows about these problems being caused but aren't doing anything. So this is my proposition. Thank you for listening.